going DOA. Why? Why did they initialize that? Did you just say dead on arrival? Probably one of my favorite, three favorite acronyms. Would that be an acronym though? Kelly, I'm not saying it's your fault. There was nothing, nothing I could have done about it. Listen, you don't have to tell me about it. I don't even know what pulmonary embolism is, but I'm pretty sure I can't make them happen. Uh, Marlene's coming with the car, so I gotta... You have got to be kidding me. You're gonna leave your girls after they've just watched one of their friends die. None of them were friends with Lucy anyway. Between you and me, Lucy was kind of a pain in the ass. She always had a note or needed to take a break, and she was always hacking up stuff. You know, the other girls thought she was I disgusting. I cannot have this conversation anymore without my head exploding. Why? Okay, you're gonna have to have one-on-ones with every girl on the team. No, I'm not. No. Why? I don't know, to make sure that none of them are traumatized or suicidal? No, no, that, that job, that's something like a guidance counselor or a vice principal should do that sort of thing. We both know that this is your job. No, I, I actually didn't know that. Now you do. Bell Bib DeVoe, now I know. Let's go. Come on, Faye. Don't be a stick in the mud. Oh, God. State your full name? Dana Marie Posniak. Great. And your age? 13. Where were you when Lucy died? Where am I always, coach? I don't know. In the game, coach, the game. In it's all the penis hole. No. You're a penis no. hole. This is it racquetball? It's basketball, you idiot. Lucy. Coach! Coach! Hester Rodriguez. Rodriguez? You didn't know that was my last name? Yeah, just never noticed. Hey. You don't look Spanish. I'm adopted. Okay. Age? I don't have a middle name either. Age? <sighs> I'm 12. Do you know what nationality you are? I'm Spanish. You don't look Spanish. You're Polish. German? I don't know. I was in foster care till I was adopted. Oh, so you're an orphan, like, uh, like Oliver. Oliver Twist? Yeah, so you're British. I don't think so. Well, you never really know, right? Okay. So where were you when Lucy died? Coach, I was standing right next to her. I'm the one who screamed. Then why didn't you do anything? Uh, I'm a kid. Fourteen. 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 Why are you so old, Joel? Age is a state of mind. So where were you when Lucy died? I was in Africa. No, you weren't. Yes, I was. No, I saw you, Enid. You were in the gym. Don't. Don't, Enid. Enid, stop it. Don't. No, put my phone down. Enid, put my phone down. Stop it. Don't touch my phone. Coach! Coach! Shannon Nicole Devine. Your age? 12. But I've already given a hand job. Hey, do you know that uh, Enid girl's 14? Yeah, I'm in banana splits with her. Banana splits? It's a dance class for kids whose parents have split up. Oh, so you guys eat ice cream and stuff? To tell me you guys at least have bananas. No, but I love bananas. Okay, all right. Where were you when Lucy died? Watching you. Why, was I doing something? Not really, but you don't have to be doing anything. Okay. You really shouldn't eat that much candy. Can I have your email address? Nope. Well, Marlene's officially pissed. Who's Marlene? My wife. Okay, is everybody okay? Does anybody want to cry or anything? Because now's the time to do it. Enid, I'm not talking about fake crying. Fuck. Anyone? Rodriguez? Posniak? Mandy? Tamblin? Banana splits? You only got 30 seconds. Fuck. No one, huh? Fuck, fuck, fuck. Anyone? Okay. No practice till Friday. But Cole! No! You're sitting right over where she died, penis hole. Ah! It's not your fault. This is the 
most homo thing I've ever had to do. I bet I'm the only one in here that isn't still a virgin. Lucy was definitely a virgin. Ugh, penis hole, definitely a virgin. And definitely disgusting. God, I hate her more than that cream corn I barfed up in fifth grade on 4th of July. I'm glad we have to write in a journal. When I become famous, I'll need this if they ever want to write a movie about me. Maybe they'll make a movie about Lucy dying, and I can play her. I'll have to gain weight, though. That's fine. Renee Zellweger had to do it. Maybe I could do Lucy with an English accent. What was Lucy? Was she German? I need to find out. Immediately! Vice Principal Faye. Enid, no talking, remember? Yeah, I, I know, but I need to know right now what nationality was Lucy. Why do you need to know? She wants to know if Lucy is a homo like her. Dana? Homo isn't a nationality, scum douche. Enid, You're show. retarded. Dana, Enid, enough. Now, I understand that this is a difficult time for you ladies. Dana, now. But that's exactly why you've been given journals, OK? So I want everybody in here now. Dana. I want everybody in here to take advantage of this private, quiet journal time you've been given. Enid, I can see quiet. I wish we had practice today. I wish we had it every day and every night. And I wish my dad would forget to pick me up one time and then coach would have to drive me home. And we'd go to the park and he'd push me on the swings and then I'd fall off and then he'd carry me all the way to the hospital, even though he has a car. And then he would cry, just a little tiny bit. Okay, I'm doing it. That's good progress, Kelly. Yeah, yeah. Right, Marlene? Marlene, I asked you not to smoke in here. <sighs> Kelly, you all right? Yeah, yeah. She's a piece of work, huh? Yeah. Yeah, yes, she is. It's not your fault. See what went wrong. Just take your time. You'll see through life. It's like no one even cares that Lucy died. I don't think anyone would have even noticed if I hadn't kept yelling. Sure. No other practices. Yeah, no, 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 great. Coach, stop playing. Coach, coach, you guys, there's something wrong with Lucy. Coach, yes. there's something no, we'll be wrong good. with we'll Lucy. Be good. We'll... You guys, yeah. coach, coach. Yeah, hang on a second, I'll call you back. Coach. God damn it, quit screaming. Coach. I'll call you right back. There's something wrong with Lucy. What in the hell's going on? I don't know, she just fell over. Oh, fuck, move back, move back. Lucy, Lucy, shit. Motherfucker, Lucy, don't you die on me, Lucy. Lucy! Breathe, Lucy! Motherfucker, shit! Come on, Lucy! Lucy, fuck! 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 Fuck. I can't be the only one who cares. I'm not looking. Look, no one's going back out into that gym until we can make sure a breakdown's not gonna happen. Because right now's your opportunity. You have five seconds. Okay, that's it. Let's get out there. This is boring. <laughs> Enid, Janet, get back in there. We're gonna play one. But coach, I can't. Yes, you can. Do it, penis hole. Kozniak, shut it. Coach, I'm on your side. Yeah, I don't want anybody on my side. I need four laps. Oh, fine. You too, Enid, four laps. I'm gonna tell my dad. Great, tell him after you do four laps. 
Go. Mandy, Esther, you guys are captains. I'm depressed! Well, Coach, you always make me captain. Take four, Esther. You know what, everybody take four laps. Take eight, 16 laps. I don't care. Just start running till I get tired of watching you run. Go. You too, Shannon, go. Lion, take four laps. Wait. No, no. You'll die. Marlene, they both told me you said what I was okay from doing that. What is going on in here? Oh, shit. I, I'll call you back in five. No, you won't. Yes, I give, will. Give me your phone. No. Now. No! Just give it to me. Oh, God damn it. Unbelievable. What are you doing? We have your life Wrapped up and rectified It must be Can I have my cell phone back now? Oh, come on, don't be all mad now. I'm not all mad. A girl dies on your team, on your watch, and you're doing the bare minimum to get your girls through it? No. no. You're a grown man. You have a wife and stepdaughters. Do you think a grown man acts like this? I need to see a change in your attitude, and I need to see you care about the girls more. Am I being clear? Would you like for me to take four more laps? I don't care. I'm just really disappointed right now. Four more laps, Fabe. Taking them. And my daddy came into my room and he said, <laughs> he said, you gotta go tell your goodbyes to Duke. Duke was our dog. He was a black lamb and he was the only dog I'd ever known for like 14 years. That must have been difficult. You know, it was. It was. You had dog cancer. Now, why do dogs get cancer? Why do dogs get cancer? Oh, there you are. Any progress? With? The whole Lucy situation. How are the girls doing? I'll say it again, they're fine. Oh, they're fine. Okay, I want you to read this. That's from Esther Rodriguez's journal. Oh. You read their journals? They know that I do. They do? They turn them in at the end of every day. They have to know. Right, but you haven't technically told them, right? Why do you care? You said I need to start caring. Yeah, but I didn't think you actually would. Are you locked out? Listen, you girls got to be more careful. People are spying on you. Why would people be spying on us? Because the whole thing with that girl dying. Lucy? Yeah, Lucy. Are there more dead girls I don't know about? You're treating me like a suspect, and I don't appreciate it. You probably did kill her penis. Posniak! Oh, shut it! Look, no one killed Lucy. Now, you guys are writing journals, right? Yeah. Yeah, how do you think I know about that? Are you guys even thinking about that right now? I told you the other day that we were writing in journals. You did, but that's not how I know about it. Well, that doesn't make any sense. All right. Well, how about this way, then? Someone not named any of you guys told me about it. But I did tell you. You speak in circles to unnerve me, yet I'm not unnerved. Listen, I can protect those journals. To be found today. So you took their journals? Not without a fight. Can I ask you what good this is doing? Isn't it may you ask, Faye? Listen, I just don't want a bunch of people reading what these girls are writing. This is their personal and private thoughts. It's bad enough they had to watch that girl die. 
You know what, I'm gonna let this one go because for once you seem to actually care about the girls. Care is a strong word. I do believe in privacy, though. Privacy is America, so this is my way about caring I about I don't America. understand why you can't admit that you just care about the girls, period. Well, I just don't understand then why you don't fire me, period. Because I don't think you want to be fired. Me neither, but I'll tell you this, these girls really unloaded in these journals. I mean, these things are like therapists that you don't have to listen to or pay for. Hey, just between you and me, I hate to admit this, but you might be onto something here, Faye. You think so? Yeah. Oh, hey, Shannon. Oh, sorry, I'll just come back later. No, honey, you can come in. I need to show Coach something in private. No, no you don't. Okay. Okay. I don't even want to know. Me neither. Me neither. <laughs> Let it out. Okay, I'm doing it. And then I go went down to his doghouse. I didn't. I didn't. Move. I didn't understand what you just said. I went down to his doghouse, and he wouldn't even move. Okay. Because he was dead. <laughs> he wasn't dead yet. My dad had to, had to put him down. All right, let it out. Well, my dad had to put him down. He called the vet. <laughs> oh, God. The vet came over. He was like, Dr. Death. He was like, oh. Okay. <coughs> that must have been difficult. That's why I don't go to vets. Well, you don't have a need right now. Yeah, right now. <laughs> hey, coach! Marlene, how long are you gonna yell at me about this? No, I just wanna know so I can plan around it. I told you I forgot something. Yes. No, I'll be home in like 20. Yeah. Yes, okay. Yeah, yeah, yes, okay, bye. Jesus Christ. Dear Journal, 